Welcome back. <laughs> Welcome back. You know what, what day of the month it is? Or better yet, you know what month it is? Because huh. I think I've lost count. I'm not sure. It's June! Yeah, it's June. How y'all doing today? How y'all doing? <laughs> um, how you like that for an intro? But, um, it is June. So, like I said yesterday, I'm going to keep this going all month. We're going to do this all month. You know, we're going to have a, we're going to have a good time with this motivational June. So, I rambled on yesterday because I was trying to explain it. But, today, I'm not going to do that much. I'm not going to do it as much. Even though I'm doing it right now. But I'm not going to do it as much. Um, but what I really want to do is just... Since I explained it yesterday, I just want to get into these into this quote. Don't worry about yesterday. Yesterday is gone. You only have today. You might not even have tomorrow. All you have is today. Right here. Right now. So. That's pretty much just. Stop trying to focus on. Don't, don't focus too much on the past. You know use it. Use it to fuel your experience. Use it as lessons learned on what on what to do now. On how to better yourself now. How to help yourself now. Because you need to go through those things in the past to get you to be who you are right this very moment. You needed those things. And you need this moment right here to fuel your tomorrow. So, I think it's important to... Don't take for granted the day that you're in right now. The day, the exact day that you're in. Don't take it for granted. I know we like to, we like to dwell on the past. We like to, like, you know, reminisce in the past. Or we like to focus on what we're going to do tomorrow. Or what we're going to do a month from now. What we're going to do, uh... You know, I mean, what we're going to do a week from now, what we're going to do a month from now, what we're going to do a year from now, you know. I think, you know, you should focus on your future, but you should focus on your future and use your past to help you get to where you want to go. But you can't take it for, you can't take for granted where you are right now. Because at that point, you're not even really living. You're just going through the motions. You're just trying to get to the next day, you know. And I know a lot of, and I know there's a lot of people out there that are trying to get through the next day. Um, I myself, I've had, mo I've had like times in the past where it's been kind of hard for me to focus on right now. And it was honestly, it was a thing where I was kind of like, this is something that I want to enjoy. This is something that I really do enjoy, but I can't find, I can't get the enjoyment out of it right now. It's not as fun as what I want it to be. You know, in my mind. And I had to put myself, I had to like train myself to focus on now. It's really, it, it, I'm still, I still struggle with it sometimes too. You know, I, when you have moments where you lose your way or, you know, you suffer through burnout or you just like, you're, 
like on autopilot for so long you're just you're you're like you're going to work you're going to school you're doing the gym even the gym could be like that too you're going to work you're going to school you're going to the gym you're doing that every week week after week after week you're building up that consistency you're building up the discipline but at the same th you're building that up but at the same time when you're constantly doing the same thing every day and you're constantly doing the same thing every week it's kind of like at a certain point you got to take a break you got to change up you got to do something different you know um and the thing is it it helps you when you do that it helps you focus on the moments that are the still moments the moments that where that aren't too eventful the moments that you feel impatient to get through you know and it's like it's situations where oh my gosh i'm sorry about that it's situations where you try to figure out how how you could best get to where you want to go as fast as possible but in the process of that you're not even present where you are. You're not even present. You're just, what would it be? You're just living life. You're just living life in a, you're on autopilot. It was something I was trying to think of. I, I can't even remember it right now. It's tough, though. It's tough. But you do have to just think about... Because um, when you're going through these things... And you know that they're building blocks for your future... You're building up a hundred todays, a thousand todays, a million todays to get to your best tomorrow. And those days, every single day, those days become the past. And so when you look back on the past, if you do, don't don't look too much into it. Don't look into it too much. If when you look into it, See what you like. See if that suited you. If that fit at that moment, or if it, it made sense. When you're in a better space, space of mind, or your better state of mind, like did that space, did it, did it fit in that space? Did it make sense to do that at that time? And if it didn't, then you have today. You have today to um. To improve that outcome for tomorrow. So you have the past. You use that as experience. You have the future. Where you're building a hundred todays. A thousand todays. But. Today. Is the building block. Today is the thing that is fueled by. The past and the future. The present. That's why it's called the present. Because it's a gift. That not everybody can get. Not everybody can get. Because some people didn't get today. They may have gotten yesterday. But they don't get today or tomorrow. So while you're here today. Focus on. Unwrapping. The present. So. You like that today? You know. I'm going to make this, like I said, I'm going to make this all month long. So, if you don't find motivation in it, in certain things I said one day, you'll find it in another day. So, yeah. Hope you like, share, and subscribe. And I'm out of here. Ah!